people of the interwebs, welcome back to my Let's Play of Tomba 2, The Evil Swine Return for Ergognica. I am Wandergirl108. Uh, we are in the fourth world now, and Kynan told us that it was going to be the pig town, even though it was supposed to be the circus town. And he said that we didn't know what he meant when we saw it, but I don't know really, uh, what? Um... Um, lady? What? Visitors are a rare event around here. Well, long ago, this used to be the home of a wonderful circus. But as you can see, this village has been cursed by the evil pigs. All the villagers have been turned into pigs. So I guess you're not actually a villager. Naturally, they can't speak human language anymore either. What shall we do? But if you could talk to the villagers, we could solve this problem. If you put on a pig suit, you'll be able to understand the pig language. Yep, magic pig suits are a thing. Look, there is a child wearing one now. That's a pig suit. There are only two pig suits in this village. This is obviously one of them. Do you see the closet key hanging on the wall of that hut? That key opens the closet holding the pig suit. The closet's in the circus warehouse. It's easy to find. Alrighty then. So yeah, we can't talk to any of these people yet. We can once we acquire a pig suit. I'll talk to that person later. Um... Hello there. Do you know who I am? A monster pig caught me in the forest and made me like this. It was fun at first, with no one noticing me, but now I want to be normal again. You're the first one to notice me. That makes me feel so hungry. Do you have any food? Just in case you weren't sure what you were supposed to do about this situation. Dried fish. What strange food. I hope I can handle this food in my current condition. What? I'm uh, ba back to normal. Whoopee. You can see me, can't you? Thank you. What can I ever do to repay you? Amazing! You really are! You look like you've been to and fro! I've got it! I know something that adventurers should know about! This world has a number of towers in it, you know. The entrances are usually hidden, but if you approach the towers properly, the entrances appear. I never found out how, though. You'll have to find that out on your own. What useful information! You'll surely be the one to discover all the towers. Get out there and find them. I guess the only thing he can really tell you is that uh, the doors aren't just there. You can't just find the door. You have to find the spot where the door is. Which I think was a really, really clever thing to do, personally. I liked it a lot. Alright, so all of this world, I guess, for lack of a better term, is free roaming. There is no combat here. There are no enemies, there's just 
this full 3D realm. Which I honestly don't really like. It's kind of clumsy. I mean, it's not so bad with the, you know, D-pad, but it, it's, it's still a little clumsy. Hello there. I can't speak to you. See, there's a ghost sticker all the way over here, and you'd think it'd be really hard to reach it, so, like, the antidote fruit would be in here, right? No, no, it's right next to a ghost pig. And that sticker just takes you back to the start of the Donglin Forest. Statue. Flower. Now we can't understand them, but we still have to speak to them to activate certain events, like so. Sad biggie. That's a place we just can't reach. We can't use the seesaw? Surely we could put something on it. Hmm. So, uh, the last video sounded alright, so I think I'm just gonna go with the settings I have now. I love the way treasure chests shatter like that. So satisfying. Anyway, um, I looked up the soundtrack for this game because personally I really like it. Apparently it's something it got severely criticized for um, by like, you know, critics. <laughs> but um, I, I really like it. Um, some tracks are better than other others, obviously, and my favorite hasn't happened yet. Uh, so, you know, there's that. But and this one here isn't my favorite, but I looked it up because some games uh, like to make their music or just, oh hello, they just generally make their music actual pieces of music, you know, with actual heart to them. And for some, it's just, uh, yeah, we, we grab the ball and we send it up there so we can throw it at the bird. Anyway. And some games just make tracks to make backgrounds for different events and then just name them after the event. Like in Portal 2, um, the entire soundtrack, everything is named after the first thing a character says when the event happens, or when the music happens. So it's really kind of sad, for the most part, even though the music is good. And this game is one of those. Like this is just... Conversations and events relaxed. That's what that track is called. Everything is just very obvious. And then in some games, if you actually look at the soundtrack, you'll see that they actually have like names and thought behind them. And I'm actually thinking of starting up a second series sent uh, focused on that because I, I do I love music. Anyway, so we can't communicate with this guy with words, but we do have the thing he needs. <laughs> Can't remember if this is conversations and events engrossed or conversations and events intrigued. I think it's engrossed. Yeah, it's... <laughs> the track naming is really lame for this game. So anyway, yeah. We can't use words, but here's the thing you want. Use it. You know, I could show you my favorite track right now. I'd just rather do things in a more linear manner, I guess. Alright, so now we've got the bridge. And now, we can just steal this key. That thing 
there comes into play as well. A big thing. Let's see now. The pig soup. Here it is. This must be it. So now, we must become pigs. Be the pig. Be the weird, ugly, walking pig. Hello, giant thing. Hello, person. Can I talk to you now? Oh, bouncing on a ball is hard. That's enough for today. Hey, where'd the ball go? Yeah, sorry about that. I kind of took it. What's this? A pig suit? The one in the closet, right? Sure, you're free to use it. At first I thought that these purple ones were female and these green ones were male. I'm still not sure if that's the case or not. Um... So... Yeah, now we can talk to people. A blank space on the Adventure Notes event page means that some adventures have yet to be tried. How many adventures are there? I'd like to try them all. 140-something, I believe. 130-something. Oh, blessed bonds. You produced water so well before, yet now you have stopped. This flower was blooming so well, too. Is there a connection? The blessed bonds has not been idle, but I had many worries and things to consult about. Isn't there some way for you to get back to your normal state of health? Yeah, these flowers, you've probably noticed them. I passed by quite a few. They're scattered all over the game. And they're all withered. But if you give them water, they bloom. And if you give all of them water, this guy wakes up. Neat, huh? Your friend Charles? Oh yeah, this guy tells you where Charles is in case you don't know. Like, you know how there are three events where Charles needs your help? They happen in order, in case you don't know where they are. Or where he is, sorry. Or I guess where the events are, you can come to this guy and he'll tell you. But since... Oh, wait. What? He's stuck in the leaves and can't move? You need a bug or something that eats leaves. Oh, I guess maybe he gives advice if you've already found him. Okay. Alright, whatever. <laughs> hmm, if I don't crack it, this body will get out of shape. But this body... Yeah, you're kind of stuck being out of shape, buddy. This well has had a lid on it for many years. The pig tribe is rumored to be hiding something in there. Look at that heavy alloy lid. Human strength just isn't enough for this. Hmm. We're here practicing our acts. But of course, we've all been turned into pigs. I wonder what this guy has to say. We've helped you out, now we can talk. What do you have to say? I wondered what would happen when Joker Arm took that cog. I'll hold the bridge down. Go on and cross. Joker Arm? Okay, if anyone knows what the heck he's talking about, please let me know in the comments. This is a flower box, but nothing's growing in it. If I find a flower seed, I'll plant it here for you. Ah. Now this event here. Oh, it's... An undiscovered gem. Of sorts. Remember how I said that some events... That if you have, like, data from the first game on the same memory card as whatever you're playing with now, 
and you know have this save file on, you can um, you get special things. You get special events, four of them to be exact, I believe. This is actually one of them. So unless you have the first game and have data on your PlayStation on your memory card, you will never know what this means. You will never get a flower. So I have never had a flower. So... Hello there, very elderly pig. Huh. Ah, excuse the mess. I'm in the middle of peanut here. You see, boy, the circus is closed right now. No way, really? I wanted to see the circus. Hmm, I'm confused. What's the matter? It appears he came to this village to see the circus. So apparently Zippo can talk to the pigs now too. Even though Tombo's the one wearing the suit. Okay. But with all the villagers turned into pigs, we're just not set up to run a circus. The clown is particularly popular. No, no way. I'm not leaving until I see the circus clown. I understand how the kid feels. But even the clown has been turned into a pig and has no confidence. Now if you're playing this as a kid and you don't know what that word means, <laughs> ah, it's funny. But if he could just get his confidence back. They talk about it like it's a material possession or a semi-material possession, I guess. Like it's an actual quantitative thing. I always thought it was until I learned what the word actually meant. It's kind of like how I used to think that my dad being faint of heart was an actual medical condition. <laughs> yeah. Good times. Good, innocent, ignorant times. Hmm. I guess it's too hard for one person to do. Hmm? Hey! Just what I need! You guys busy? Yeah, I'm sure. You just have that nothing to do look. I want to practice a new trick. What? It's too dangerous for one person. Actually, there's a boy who wants to see the clown circus. What? I see. At any rate, I won't know what I can do until I try. But I can't do it in front of the other. All right, let's get started. Hello. We've run into Pushier. Ready? First, take this. I'm going to be practicing on this rope. If I fall, try to catch me on that map. Ready? Here I go! And he will fall. And when he does, we have to catch him. Ugh! Can I please... Pick this up. Oh! No, 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 no! No, Mr. Clown, no! No, 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 no! Oh, this is where the controls get really annoying. <sighs> oh, no! Oh! Fizz dispensers. Sorry. I'm counting on you. I really detest pain, you know. I'm sorry. It's just kind of hard to keep control of this thing. Ah! No, 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 no! Oh! Uh. See, this is why I don't like these um, I really 3D movement areas. Just because the controls can be so... <sighs> Meh. Can you fall when I actually have the mat in position to catch you? Please. Not wait until I can't catch you. That would be lovely. I'm counting on you. I really did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait. The 
The controls are good in the 2D areas, or the 2.5D areas, but... Impressive for a pig. Oh, thank you. I got a little confidence back. See, they talk about it like it's something you can quantify, which is not useful for the mind of a child who hasn't heard the word before. Oh yeah! There's a child waiting for me, right? Yes! The old man with him looked upset too! I saw him from atop the rope. It looks like the pig tribe just doesn't get along well with the kid. Pigs? Aren't they just people cursed by the evil pig to look like pigs? Ah, oh, that's true about us. But the pig tribe has always looked like pigs. They're smart and know a lot. If you can talk to them. Tomba, do you think they would know about the evil pigs too? Well, of course. All right. Well, I have to go entertain a little guest. You can come too if you like. And must. Okay, so... Tightrope walking. He was great. <laughs> uh, you did, huh? I can do that. Look. Wow! Great! Marvelous! Very impressive for a pig. That's all I know right now. I know. A flying peon. Wanna see one? Huh? A peon's here? Yes, yes, let's go see it. Hey, wait! You'll get lost! <laughs> Kids! Thank you! A child's laughing face is better for me than any medicine. Aww. The artists in this game really are... True artists. Like, all of them. It's actually kind of impressive. really been a help. I've got to pay you back some. Performing is an art, you know. Well, we want to ask a question about the evil pigs. Okay, I understand. Let's go down to our pavilion. He means up. I'll tell you what I can there. Is my mic still working? Pretty cool! It isn't often that the pig tribe invites others to their pavilion. Mr. Clown, hurry, hurry up. I'm coming. I'm on my way now. See you later. I like his voice. His voice is fun. Is my mic actually working right now? Like, I can't even tell if it's only picking up half my voice or I don't know. Ugh, I wish I could tell, like, while recording, when my mic starts to glitch. So, um... You've been a big help. Thank you. What's this sign here? information on something that doesn't make any sense yet. I've been waiting for you. First, let me express my gratitude. Thank you 
With your help, the village clown has regained his confidence. <sighs> In case you're wondering, confidence is not a quantitative thing. What I wanted to ask about was the evil pigs. No, that was what we wanted to ask about. Yes, of course. Our dear friend was kidnapped by the evil pigs. Hmm. Flame. Ice. Goat. This particular piece is called Conversations and Events. Danger. I always thought it was epic until I knew that was what they named it. I see you have already acquired three pickbacks. Second favorite track, by the way. As you know, you can't find an evil pig hiding place unless you own the right pickbag. If you don't know which evil pig kidnapped your friend, you'll have to fight them all. Do you understand? We understand. We have to get two more pig bags. Pig bags are always found in magically cursed places. So the evil pigs kind of curse themselves when they curse a the land because they also create the instruments of their own destruction. Hmm? In other words, one is in the village and one is in the Temple of Water. Well, you have to open the road to the Temple of Water. The Water Temple! First, come this way. Take this wooden statue and break it. From danger to relaxed. Lovely. I'm gonna be commentating on the music from now on as well, just because I know I'll never be able to make another Let's Play out of this about the music because they didn't really put heart into the music. Actually, this wooden statue is made out of the oak tree. And we have been using our strength to protect it. Do you see that well over there? There's a book hidden in that well called the Carpenter Book, which you can use to break the wooden statue. The well is covered by a heavy alloy lid. Will you bring me the Carpenter Book? To do that, take this. This? This is what the flying peon likes. It's found in the circus where- That big thing. Flying Payon to pull off the lid. That's right, but be careful. Lead him out. If you fail and he takes the Payon grass, you can just come back here to me. Okay, I should really end the video now. So, thank you so very much for watching. If you did, I really do appreciate it, and I look forward to seeing you next time.